Good morning, Virginia. This is Virginia This Morning. Welcome back to the show with Valentine's Day tomorrow. It's a great time of year to show and tell your family how much you love them. Love is a beautiful thing and can last through the decades. Recently, our Bill Bevins met with Patty and Kent Bailey, who share their love story that spans nearly 50 years so far. Kent has even written a series of love songs for his wife. Take a look. There is a secret deep in my heart that's for so long. It's the time of year when love and romance are top of mind and hopefully in our hearts. And so when we received a new CD of old fashioned love songs just in time for Valentine's and discovered the entire CD from local man Kent Bailey was written for his wife, Patty. This August, they'll celebrate their 50th wedding anniversary. We asked them to share some of their love story with us, starting at the beginning when they met while still in high school. Not much. A group of girls decided that we would indeed start selecting from a younger group of guys. <laughs> <laughs> and since we were seniors and they were sophomores, we, we picked uh, three guys and Kent was, was my pick. She was Miss Princeton, West Virginia and was also homecoming queen. I was kind of impressed, you know. Just for you, love is good. Love is right, love is true. It, it's really true, we don't have very many, we don't have very many fights uh, because we agree on just about everything. We agree on politics, uh, we go to the same church. The love between us has never faltered. We've had that kind of uh, stability between us. There's never been doubts between us. Righteous for you. He probably started out by forgetting my birthday, though, or forgetting an anniversary. And this is the way he, he always makes it up. He write a song or write a poem, uh, have a very old poem framed over on the wall that was in the 1960s, that I believe that was a forgotten birthday. Yeah. And it's, it's, a, it's a beautiful poem. I mean, what could, what could you, what's nicer than having a song written for you and dedicated to you? Uh, there is one song on there, and it is the one directly dedicated to her, That's a Day Without You. It's the name of the album, and uh, it just fits us perfectly. I depend on you to make my day. I don't know why, it's just that way. Love is true. Still singing love songs after all these years. What a great story.